Hello, welcome to this video tutorial. If you have developed your application with Node.js and SPSJS and unable to load the image and other file, then this tutorial is for you. So let's go back to the documentation and let's go back to the before going there let's create a small uh, node.js application. So So it's okay. Now, if we open the JavaScript file, we we'll see this declaration here. We are loading the modules. Then we try to get an instance of SPSJS, and then here, whenever uh, the is loaded with the root, then this image will be sent. This uh, message "Hello world" will be sent. And now, let's go to our server and start it. Not yes, pump. Now, uh, if you go and then local os, right, local os 3000, then hello, we are getting hello world. So now you want to replace this text hello world with a web page. So to do that, here you want like to create this web page here with small, simple content. Then go here instead of sending text we are going to send uh, a web page called index.html that is located in our root directory so let's go back here now if we refresh it nothing is happening let us stop our server restart it again then now uh, refresh it so now we are getting our web page now suppose you want to display an image here so to do that we are going to the uh, HTML file then write the stack here here we specify the name of the image and the remaining one is styling on alternative text so then normally what will what will happen so if we go and restart our server go here we can expect to see the image here so but that's not happening the image is empty and if you try to inspect it then you can see here like you are get, getting this load failing to load uh, the resource so we are going we are getting the 404 error message meaning resource not found so what to do now let's go to what uh, express yes document is it's saying that in order to save static file in express.js we have to use a specific function called express.static and pass the name of the directory where our resource is located so to do that one and resources can be a CSS file images and other and other type of files so so to do that one here we are going to take this one here public use this expression here and go to app.js place it there and now let's restart our server Still, we are unable to get the image. We are unable to get the image. So, the documentation is saying that we have to we have to create to pass 
directory create a direct name public can be anything so let's create one directory called public here and here we create the public then take our image and put inside then now go and restart our server and refresh it bam so we can now successfully load our image so same thing like we can continue and try to play around it like go in here and then create another image another folder take our image and put in that means that we should come here and then specify the img as part to our image and if we go here and refresh it to so our image is still loading so I hope this uh, tutorial has been useful to you and for now you will be able to load all your resources in your SPSJS application. So if you have any problem or any comment, any opinion, do not hesitate to drop your comment. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video tutorial. Bye.